Okay, so this is part two. There's some of my die cast. There's some candy. There's another die cast. And then up there is some 164s. And then here is some haulers. And then some more in depths of the 164 cars. Sounds like a better angle, but these are more 164s. There are some more up here. There's a Mater I got from McDonald's adult toy. Um, another one of the wacky race cars, the great old pervert. Um, these are some of the Ryan Blaney's I have. And then here's some other 164s, that's a Casey Atwood. And then down here, we have like, I think they're one twelfth scale. And then here's, these are all the Fords. And then up here, I couldn't really fit the rest of them. So you have some Fords there. Mostly this is Chevrolet, there's, um, the race win version of Daniel Hemrick's win. You have Ryan Blaney's Daytona win up there. And then you have the diecast I showed. So anyway, that's more, there's some Hot Wheels. There's a few there by the bed. I do have one Indy car and it's a Target one. And then you have a sealed copy of NASCAR 2005 Chase for the Cup. Here's a few signed hero cards. And then this probably here is my most prized possession. This is signed by Brad Keselowski. So really cool. And it's something that is definitely a centerpiece in my collection. Then you have another signature, Brad Keselowski up there. And then a NASCAR historical collection, which is kind of cool. There's a race wind sticker in there. And then here's some Paul Menards. And then a few Packer die casts. Obviously, I'm from Wisconsin. So that's more of the in-depth. Then you have, there's the clocks that I mentioned. There's one up there. I have a Matt Kenseth one, but that book is kind of covering it. And then there's a few other candy jars up there. There's a remote control 30 Pennzoil. There's a 32 Give Kids the World, and then a toy car of the 18 of Kyle Busch. Then you have another Kenny Irwin over there. So that's mostly just an in-depth of my collection. So, hope you enjoyed.